Hey there, and welcome to Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2 Beta. We are trying our hand at the Tyranids. I'm going to quickly show you the layout. I'm picking a battleship here. Acid infestation, so it has the longest range super heavy pyro acid artillery. And it also has a launch base. So we're going to be launching lots and lots of fighters. You can see here we also have uh, the corrosive clutch devourer. So massive claws, um, which is nice, and then the pyro acid battery weapons along with the launch base. So we'll be leveraging those fighters heavily. We're going to grab spore clouds to slow them down and psychic scream to implement morale loss as we board them. We can hopefully uh, take them out. I would like to grab, what do we want here? Pyro acid weapons critical chances are increased, that's nice. And um you don't have many line ships. So we're gonna get acid blood. So if we're damaged under 50% and they're chasing us, we're gonna leave a trail for them to take damage. So we'll see if this works. It works about 50-50% of the time. Um half the time someone disconnects or can't connect and then it cancels out. This is a beta. I am a little disappointed um, given the number of challenges it has. Like I said, 50-50% of the time it works. I know it's a beta. I appreciate that. But being a huge fan of the first uh, Battlefleet Gothic Armada, uh, that game had a lot of bugs throughout its lifespan, honestly. Uh, so I'm hoping on this one, at least when it comes to launch on January, they were able to work out a lot of these bugs and uh, fix it. Overall, the gameplay is very similar to the first one. The big difference is you have different factions and ships and abilities. I think they've done a nice job in the layout. I played the first mission. The second one didn't work for me in the prologue. Uh, but the interesting backstory, I do think there is a little more to the single player campaign in this one. I think, if I'm not mistaken, there'll be three main factions you can play through, which I'll be interested to see. One of my big complaints with that, though, is that the missions were very repetitive in the first one. So I'm hoping in uh, this one they're not as re re repetitive. It does look like uh, we loaded up, so we will have a nice little battle here. We're going to basically try to eat the enemy ships and not get caught out or focus fire down. It looks like... what are they, what are they bringing to the table? Alright, so they should have, hopefully some lance uh, you know longer range than us would be my hope uh, we're gonna stick with them but we will also grab this one over here all right we're gonna ready up so with tyranids you do remain hidden which is nice until you hit sensor range um, and then what you have is this maneuver skill rush. So we can go 180 degrees any direction and we rush there. Um, you know, for two seconds we're at 2,000 ship speed. So this is excellent for ramming. What I'm going to try to do here is brace for impact. And... Um, reduce hull damage. And another thing that's nice is that when you rush, you don't get detected. So you can see there off the bat. Um, yeah. So this is a little orca. Do I waste? What did I do? here you can see them go bat and bug the hell out of them you have seized a strategic now, I area. do want to head directly there and cap it the enemy has seized a strategic All area right, so these guys are hiding over there um
Tyranids are fairly slow. The enemy has seized a strategic Even area. this ship, I think, is only 200 speed, which is fairly slow for an escort. Uh, what is this guy doing? You have seized a strategic area. With support with the fighters, I'm hoping we can take them out. Looks like they do have ships there. I'm gonna try to catch up with our guy. enemy has seized a strategic area. So their sh escort ships are coming at us. Alright, so these guys are... So we're gonna, we're gonna make, we are gonna make a play at that guy. We're also going to. What is he doing? shields um, race for impact oh geez race for impact of strategic points. Sacrifice herself. Yep. Oh, 
base for impact. Okay, we need. We're gonna head over here. What's left? Oh, come on, guys, go get him. That's how I play Tyranids. We really got in there. A lot of melee damage. Alright, there we go. Come on, swarm. Ah. Disengaging. left. Alright, someone's clearly left. The other group was mutinying, so I don't think they have a lot of recourse. There we go. So that's how we play Tyranids, guys. On that one, I got kind of caught there. Um, but you could see just you rush at them, brace for impact, and do massive, massive damage. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and catch us in the next video coming up shortly here. I'll be posting several different factions. I appreciate uh, feedback, constructive criticism, and hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Shadow Coast out.